Hello viewers, thanks for watching our videos. If not yet subscribe, please subscribe and click the bell icon. So actually, name the 3D objects what they are given. Name the 3D objects or shapes that can be formed from the following nets. So let's take from this hexagonal. So let's write hexagonal pyramid. So what is this name? Is hexagonal pyramid. Hexagonal pyramid. Why? Because all the faces are joining at one point. This is that point. So are joining at this point. So how you can draw like this? Also you can draw like this. So keep one point. You'll have. So this is hexagonal pyramid. Our next one is, if you join all these eight, you'll get this all like cuboid. So this is like cuboid. How you will get roughly? I'll give like this. So let's take. So this is cube white. Our next one is this one, pentagonal pyramid. So these are all joined at one point. That is, pentagonal pyramid. So let's take pentagonal pyramid. How it will be roughly? I'll give. So all the things are joining at this point. So it's joining like that. So here it's joining like that. So all the points are joined. So this is pentagonal pyramid. Our next one is what is that here? You'll get. So what is this? You'll get actually cylinder. So cylinder. How you'll get this cylinder roughly? So you we'll have like this shape cylinder. Next one is let's take what you'll get. After cylinder, you'll get cube. So cube, how it will be normally? All the faces will be equal. So like this cube. Our next one, what you'll get here is again hexagonal pyramid. So this is also hexagonal pyramid. So how many sides? One, two, three, four, five, six. For that, this is hexagonal. So if four, seven sides are there, heptagonal. Uh, nine, eight, octagonal. Nine. So like that, it will going to move. So for this, what you'll get here is normally. So all the points are joined at one place. So all the points are joined. So this is hexagonal pyramid. Next one is what you'll get here is trapezoid. So what is meant by trapezoid is here trapezium shape is there. So this are all trapezium shape. However, you'll get. So we'll get like this. Trapezoid shape will be like this. We will get. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Hello viewers. In this question, what they are given is draw the following diagram on the check ruled book and find out which of the following diagrams makes cube. So actually, the conditions are there is so how to make easily to tell is so. Let's take three steps at there. So first step, so first stage or second stage and third stage. In first stage, you'll have definitely one square. Definitely one square. In third stage also, definitely one square. It may be anywhere. Definitely one square. 
in middle center it should contain definitely four squares so as i told here one two three four is there then top one down one so that is five and six yes is that possible or not yes it is one top stage one and stage two four at the stage two, four, three one square is there for that is yes it is possible next one here one two three four is there middle middle stage so or step two step two step one step three so middle four are there top one and down one yes it is also possible next one is so one two three four top five down six x it is also possible next one so what is our next one is here here one two three four top five down six s yes, it is also possible next here is that making cube or not s yes, obviously it is one two three four then five six s yes, it is possible next one so here one two three four five six top one is there down one is there middle three is there yes it is also possible next one here let's check this is top one yes it is there then down middle only three is there it's not equal to four it's not equal to four one two three here then down one two so yes it's not possible why because not possible to make cube so it's not possible to make cube why because middle stage that is second stage only three are there it is not four next one so here in stage one one is there here one two three then here one two is there here not equal to four stage two should be not possible not possible to make cube then our next one is so here one two three then here one two so here middle second stage it should be contained for so second stage it should be contained for so for that it is not possible so it should contain three one two three one two three there is no start stage that is there is no step so, so it's not possible second stage it's not equal to four four squares middle one so like above pictures so this is not possible so let's take this is stage one two one two then one two so number of squares are there but middle stage is not equal to four then it's not possible so it is also not possible so like that Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Hello viewers. Thanks for watching our videos. Our next question is continuing here. Name the polyhedron which has four vertices, four faces. So actually, let's take like this. Four vertices, four faces. So here, how many vertices are there? This is one face. How many vertices are there? Here, one, two, three, four. So normally what you can write for this is tetrahedron. Tetra means four, hedron means polyhedron. Tetrahedron. This is four faces. Next one. Name the solid object which has no vertex. So which has no vertex means it definitely is like square, circle, not square, circle. Then it will have shape of sphere. So it will have shape of sphere. So what is that shape? Sphere. It's like ball. There is no vertex for this. Next one. Name the polyhedron. Name the polyhedron which has twelve edges. Which has twelve edges. So twelve edges means let's take cube like this. So front four, back four, eight, then surrounding four. 
just this is 12 edges Q will have 12 edges regular polyhedron where Q body is not name the polyhedron means it should be regular name the solid object which has one surface so which has one surface what is that which has one surface So name the polyhedron which has one surface that is also only one surface it will be like sphere. So I am writing D here it will be sphere only one surface there is no vertex for this means sphere. There is no vertex for this means it is sphere. So for C it will be 12 edges it may be cube or it may be some cuboid for C it is maybe cuboid also so it will have 12 edges cuboid also next one E how a cube is different from cuboid cube is regular polyhedron cube is regular regular means all the sides are equal regular polyhedron that is all sides are equal in length like square cuboid is not all cuboid not is not regular polyhedron regular polyhedron next our next one is yeah which two shapes have same number of edges, vertices and faces. Obviously it is cube and cuboid. Cuboid. Both will have so 12 edges. Then vertices will be 8. Then faces will be 6. Then name the polyhedron which has 5 vertices and 5 faces. So 5 vertices, 5 faces. So let's draw square pyramid. Square pyramid. So it will have like this shape. So how many vertices? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So what is that solution as? So what is that is for G? square pyramid for that five faces and five vertices thanks for watching please subscribe hello viewers thanks for watching our next question is write the name of the object given below so actually this face is prism it's not joining at vertices the faces only one face should be there for the so pyramid means it will join at one point so name the object means here how many sides are there how many sides are there here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 obviously it is octagonal prism octagonal prism obviously it is octagonal prism next one what is our next one as so here how many sides are there 1 2 3 4 5 6 so 6 sides are there it will be hexagonal hexagonal prism why prism it is is both front and back top and bottom surfaces is there there is no vertex like that so here it will be like let's take here inward vertex that joining all the things so what you can see here third one is so this is third one this is second one so what is third one is actually it is triangular prism so from this side it is there so this side is face and this side it is face so what you can write here triangular prism triangular prism Next our fourth one is here all the points are joined at one vertex then is obviously it is a 
pyramid but what pyramid it is we have to check i think it is pentagonal pyramid why because is this one is pentagon pentagonal pyramid thanks for watching please subscribe and please watch the remaining videos also